the man that she unalived years later after she popped me is the same man she cheated on me with and had a kid by. So she had a kid by him while she was married to me. So he knew her pedigree. He knew that she popped me. He knew what type of person she was. He still brought her in his house. He still had whatever, whatever kind of relations with her. And when he fell asleep back in 2018 or 2019, whenever it was, after an argument, she put a hammer to his head and popped him three times and unalived him. It's sad but true. When you meet somebody, they should be a good balance of successes and failures. But if they all failures and no successes, you meet her, ain't got no driver's license. Got a million DUIs. Uh, was arrested and went to prison for trying to unalive her, her, her husband. Don't have custody of her kids. Why this woman, why this woman you meet got four kids, but she don't have custody of them. Why? And you think you're going to have kids by her. She going to be responsible to the four that you have with her. You meet a woman. All she do is party every weekend. And her parents is raising her son. And you think, you think you can change abroad like that? She got a son. She's a weekend mom to her son. She take him to, you know, the park. She take him out to eat. She take him to the mall and, you know, do a bunch of activities with him in the morning. And then when six o'clock, she drops him off at her parents' house so she can hang out all weekend. And this is the type of woman you choose.